Hello there, kids. It is I, Stray Cat, the one and only, coming to you with another episode of New Vegas. All right, when we Three left off... Death claws make for a lot of reconstructive surgery. Well, you're not wrong. Anyway, when we left off, I was in a bit of a pickle, but I managed to get out of that quite quickly and make my way back to the think tank and then got myself patched up by the auto dock here, who appears to be suffering from another bout of narcolepsy. Anyway... Now we're going to be going back out into Big Mountain to be gathering up more upgrade holotapes for the personalities here. Because the Lord knows there's a lot of them. Alright. Now, one of them is at the X-13 Research Facility, if I remember correctly. And... I also need to be doing that for another thing. Attack of the Infiltrator. So, quite frankly, it'd be better off going in that direction. But, there are also some things at X8 I need to do, like upgrade the Sonic Emitter. And there's actually several quests over in that direction. So, we're going to actually head over there considering that's an easier place to reach. Uh, boom Town, Target Zone, Medical Facility. Uh, the Target Zone is a little closer. Although I think there's some dogs still roaming around there. And that would put me straight through a radiation area. That would not be good. Well, not really good. Yep, I knew it would. I knew it would start doing the radiation thing. Oh, that's, uh... Deal with this. <sighs> I hate doing that. But it's necessary to keep me alive. Uh, take that and that. That's all I really need to do. And there's some other things right over there that I keep forgetting to explore. I honestly keep doing that. But I'm going to look at them later. As it stands right now, I need to head into X8 to get the upgrade for the emitter. And it is essential, believe me, to get into a lot of the places around here. You need to have it. Now, whoop. There we go. What? Whoa, 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 whoa. You just snuck up on me, motherfucker. Take that. Little shit. Jesus. Uh oh. There's another one. Okay, I missed one shot. I get I got one of the shots on the leg. There we go. There we go, at least that's done. Uh take the egg, because that actually has a lot of value. And energy cell too, why not? Reload again. There we go. Yep, nothing else out here. Whoop. There is that there. Might as well pick this up. Wonder glue. Should have figured. Nothing too valuable. There we go. Alrighty. Time to delve deeper into this hellhole. Yeah, my wrist is all screwed up today. So is my controller. It keeps making me go in a direction I'm not telling it to go. Alright. <laughs> That's a lot of procs for the list. Uh, a whole bunch of stuff I need to be doing for data retrieval and whatnot. I'll take those energy cells. At least fold them into something worth some money. Okay. X8 test subject information. In this test, you will take on the role of one of those evil commies, infiltrating an institution of honest American learning. Don't worry, citizen, it's just for pretend. Yeah. Your objective is to steal documents that a real dirty commie traitor, which you're not, could use to brainwash our children, which you wouldn't do. <laughs> oh my god, this is so 1950s. <laughs> oh jeez. This test will help us to protect our children's fragile minds from the agents of international communism. Agents like you. 
Just kidding. We know you're a loyal American, aren't you? Yeah, about that. <laughs> Institutional test internal memo. Subjects will be informed that we are gauging the effectiveness of communist infiltration of American schools. They won't know about the cyber dogs until they actually begin the testing process. I'm pretty sure you have to tell them this sort of thing. And... Um, because that could kill them. Okay, number one. Test A engages cyber dog protection protocols alongside standard automated turret systems. Those are standard in American schools now? To be fair, that makes sense nowadays for that to be happening. Anyway, test B adds protectrons to the previous test. Test B also includes some basic tests for the field disruptor com capacitance module? Field disruptor capacitance module. I think that's what it's pronounced as. I don't fucking know. Your residential test. Until further notice, please do not enter the residential CyberDog test area or conduct any experiments using it. The CyberDogs are still being programmed and any disturbance could have dramatic influence on their progress. Restricting access to the, in this fashion should also help to avoid any repeats of an incident playtime. Settlements for which are still coming directly out of our budget. Okay then. Oh, I'm no longer well rested. Oh well. Oh, I'll take these. All good stuff. There we go. What's in here? Nuka Cola. That's it. Alrighty. Is that my brain? No, it's not my brain. That's not my brain, and that's not my brain. Oh shit. Whole bunch of nothing. I'll take these empty syringes. Because you might as well, right? In this place, this day and age. Alright, whoop. There is something hostile down here. Oh! Mr. Orderly. A combat inhibitor. Let's see if we can disengage that. Or not at all. Well, that didn't work at all. Shit. The lobotomite apparently found its way in here. Oh, I don't know, but hey. If it, ha it happened... So it'll probably happen again. Let's see if we can get any critical hits on it. There we go. And there we go. That brought it down fast. Alright. Uh, energy cell, scrap metal. We're not going to pick up any of the flamer fuel because it's basically worthless. Is there anything other than this bone saw? Bone saw is ready. What is this? Dog and Robot Splicing Experiment Holotape. Hmm. That seems like it would be useful. What? I can't even look in this? Okay, then. I guess that works. The main terminal. EM Pulse Wave Module on loan. The X-13 facility has loaned us their EM Pulse Wave Module prototype for the sonic emitter for use in our data retrieval test simulations. The module allows the sonic emitter to disable certain force fields. Do not allow test subjects to leave the X-8 facility with this module. Even though it won't work outside Big Mountain, it's a security nightmare. Thank you all for your attention in this matter. <laughs> MD, PhD, D-U-M-D-D-M-D-D? -D -M -D -D? I'm pretty sure half of those were made up. Okay. <laughs> made it. Okay, I went southern there for a second. Uh, Project Burke and Project Hare. Yes, Project Burke involves what some less science-minded individuals might call grave robbing. Holy shit. Yes, we're forced into this due to budget cuts. No, none of the senior staff uses the bodies for anything else. Finally, in regards to the rumor that Project Hair engages in liquidation operations against non-military targets to procure research subjects. I will not dignify them with a response. Any other questions? <laughs> Again, the same person with all the made-up letters in there. While programming the new residential cyberdog module to retrieve objects thrown by human beings for purpose of enjoyment, I accidentally used an audio sample recording of its bark as the object to be fetched. 
Cyberdog has now become attached to the sample, and displays signs of aggressive tendencies when I attempt to recover it. That's not good. They're not trained well. I need to put them through obedience school, I think. <laughs> I have left it in the residential reconstruction area until it is needed. I believe the Cyberdog has buried it. Well, you're fucked, aren't ya? Holy shit. <laughs> he have been stealing. Oh, vodka. I guess I just did the same thing. I don't give a fuck. It was vodka. Booze is good. Medical supplies. Take all of that. Because all of that's good. Now, what is down here? This is the kennel door. Foot locker. Duct tape. Fuck yeah. Never hurts to have duct tape. It's the greatest invention ever made by man. There we go. Now, what is over here again? This is the testing facility. I need things to open. Oh, what's in the locker? Dirty water and drained cells. Hmm. Let's, uh, let's see what else is in here. Another new Coca-Cola. Okay. X8 test terminal. Enter institutional data retrieval. Basic test. For this test, you must use any means necessary to retrieve three student files from an average high school. Basic security protocols have been activated. Success. Retrieve three student files. Failure. Security measures prohibit you from retrieving the files. Which means you dead. Okay. That sounds like they're moving shit around here. That requires a key. Okay, so I'd have to go through here then. Lockpick skill is used to open locked doors and containers. No shit. Well, now we're going to dive into this experiment. Attention students. This is the pre-recorded voice of your pre-recorded principal, Dr. Uh, principal Boros. You may know me as the head chief first researcher of labs Z9 and Z14. Okay. There I fought valiantly to preserve rattlesnake DNA and put it right where it belongs, in the husk of another feared predator. Oh, um. and the tarantula hawk. Can't splice enough, I always say. Especially if you can make a magnificent cathedral. Enough about me. It has come to my attention that many of you seemingly innocent children have been subverted by red propaganda. This is the most serious matter, requiring the most serious of detentions. Can you spell detention? I'll tell you how I spell it. Death detention. Commie Pico traitors? Oh! Uh, now I will send vicious cybernetic cyborg dogs through the corridors to weed all you traitors out. Okay, that's nice. Which among you have chosen the commie path? Especially you, Betsy Bright, who turned you down to the high school dance so you could smoke with Richie Marcus. All monitors uh, will also be vigilant. Step outside during class, and they'll make sure you make a speedy jump back to your desk. Hold your urine and wait for the proper bathroom break time. Okay, a couple things. First, you're just admitted to creating casadors. Second, this what? What the hell are you even talking about? Oh, hall monitor is overclocked in the turret. Holy tits, they're all hitting me right in the face. Whew. Mere fact I survived is a miracle. Oh shit. Okay, that's not good at all. Alright. Seems a lot of Lebanamites wandered into here only to have a lot of their brain pan. Uh, smothered all over what the wolverines da foop I honestly don't know why the uh wild wasteland perk 
truck there. Wolverines. That has to be it. That, that's weird. Bake sale Friday. Fight the Red Menace with cookies. All right there, bucko. Seems like a good plan to me. Filing cabinets. Nuka Cola, per usual. Now, yep, that's what I thought. Military cyber dog. Let's see if we can get a shot on it. There we go. That was lucky as fuck. Oh shit. The other one snuck up on me. Oh shit. That one missed entirely. Now let's get this one. There we go. Whoa. The explosion knocked the Cyber Dog back. Oh boy. That was a thing. Alright, let's get all these. Oh. The Institutional Test Terminal. What information does this have? Retrieve student records. Retrieve Richie Marcus's midterm grades. English, F minus. Math, F minus. Science, F minus minus. History, F minus. <laughs> Richie Ball Lover Marcus. <laughs> oh, boy. He really did not like Richie Marcus, apparently. Apparently, he didn't like Betsy Bright either. The fuck is Betsy Bright even? That's the weird part. Doesn't make a lick of sense. And yeah, nothing's over here. So I don't know why uh, it's showing up on my radar. I guess they must be on the top floor. Maybe. What the? What the? I could have sworn I heard dog coming after me. That was weird. Okay. You are in the library. Oh. Be quiet here and filled with I didn't think there'd be any alive lobotomites here. Well, we're gonna fix that. There he goes. Goodbye. So, any others? Nope. Not really. Uh, it sounds like one was coming down a little bit. But, uh, can't really see them. Huh. Okay. Well, here's another terminal. Retrieve student records. Cherry O'Bannon's schedule. Cherry O'Bannon's after school schedule. Ballet Tuesday and Thursday, 4.30 to 6.30. Pep Squad Wednesday, 4.15 to 5.15. Tutoring Center Volunteer Monday, 4.15 to 6 o'clock. That's a little creepery. How much he knows about that. It's like really, really creepery. Okay then. Whoa, there's another one. There you are. Oh! That one hit me right in the chest. That one blew your head right off, so I think we're even. Whew. That seems like it would have hurt. Okay. Let's turn on my light. There we go, that's it. That's the ticket. Oh! Hit, 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 hit. They do not look happy. Not even slightly. Well, that's one down. This one. Yep. Okay. Do not like doing that. Not at all, but it's necessary to keep me alive. Hey, and level up. But it's not going to let me level up until I am completely and utterly safe. And my X button is sticking quite a bit. Making a weird clicking noise. You probably hear it. It's really weird. Okay. And I think the other threat is just up this way. Oh, there it is. Where's the... Oh, he has a 10 millimeter pistol. Okay, that's the weapon he has. Usually they have it right on them. There we go. And should... No? It's not going to pop it? Okay then, that's a the thing. I'll take the pistol 
as a repair tool. Okay, I thought there was something in there, and I didn't bother to check if there was an empty symbol on it or not. Okay. Uh, turrets over here. There we go. Oh, and... See if we can get the head off this one before it kills me. Oh, head's crippled already. There we go. Okay. There we go. Alright. I was wondering what it was going to proc. Okay. Level 26. Which one do I need to lift most? Uh, that'll be good for right now. Um, what else is there? Or do I really need to lift it that much? I don't think I do. Uh, it's a matter of perspective, I guess. Um, hmm. We'll just put two into explosives for right now as a little extra boost. And we'll put the other five in science and speech. Yeah, we'll do that. And we'll look at 26, I think. Yeah, nerves of steel, spray and pray. I'm just making sure I'm not missing any of the uh, stuff I want. Um, confirm bachelor. I'm just making sure I'm not missing the uh, barter one I want. Main reason I'm just jumping and throwing stuff so quickly into barter. What was the perk again? <laughs> oh, my brain's not working. Okay, uh, we'll just throw it into, uh, I think, Nerves of Steel for right now. But I just want to double check what's coming up on 28. Uh, sort of roughing it for survival at 100. Um, the main thing that I really want to get is Burden to Bear at 30. And that can wait till I hit 30. So, uh, I don't think I have first rank in Action Boy. So, Nerves of Steel can wait. First, get one into Action Boy. There we go. And I think we'll end the episode for right now. Thank you all so much for watching. Click the subscribe button if you like these videos and you want to see more. And click the like button if you like this particular video. And share and comment so we can bring more people into this community. We can talk about the games we're playing together. And take a look at my Patreon down below and decide whether you want to support this endeavor or not. It's completely up to you. And I will see y'all in the next episode. This has been the one and the only Stray Cat playing games for you.